The annual celebration of World Wetlands Day on February 2nd seeks to increase awareness of the critical importance of wetlands for both people and the environment. A cleanup campaign was organized at the mouth of the Shock River in which the Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, its sector partners as well as other surrounding private sector agencies and schools joint efforts to sensitize the public on the importance of waste management in wetlands preservation. Fisheries biologist within the Department of Fisheries, Yvonne Edwin, says that in order to slow down the rapid loss of wetlands and promote conservation and restoration efforts, it is essential to increase national and international awareness of the issue. We're at the mouth of the Shock River. There is a mangrove within this area, so we're in the Shock location, and that is why we've included um, the Sir Ira Simmons and the Castries Comprehensive School and partners and corporate citizens around this area to get them to understand. What you're seeing here is not from recreational activities or persons coming to the beach, but what is coming down from inland. And so the impact is real, as you will capture in your footage, you would see there are a lot of plastic bottles, a lot of um, garbage that comes from inland that needs to be taken out before it gets into the ocean. So this is just one area, and we have so many areas across St. Lucia that they don't get a cleanup from NCA, they don't get an active cleanup from CCC, and this is just left behind. So. Again, one small area in shock, one small activity that could help address this issue. In the past 50 years, wetlands around the world have degraded by almost 35%. According to the Deputy Chief Forest Officer, Rebecca Rock, it is becoming crucial to act in support of wetlands preservation and restoration using financial and human resources. We want people to understand that when they throw garbage into the rivers, that it comes down and it accumulates in the wetlands where because of the roots of the system, they trap the garbage in there. And that can cause a lot of flooding um, in, in the area. So we're trying to more or less, we know it is not going to solve any problems, but we're trying to see that when people see that activity, that they can think about maybe changing behaviors so that they won't throw their garbage into the rivers, they won't throw, um, the, they, they would more or less prevent others from doing the same thing so that we can actually have a better environment in St. Lucia. With World Wetlands Day being held under the theme Wetlands Restoration, Ms. Rock reiterated the importance of each person playing their part, both individually and collectively, to maintain the wetlands for biodiversity, climate mitigation and adaptation, freshwater availability and global economies. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.